Amen. Amen. Listen, I know where I have come from and where I'm coming from. Praise God. And I can see how far God is taking me. And it will take only God to bring a person like me from where he took me up to where I am living today and to where I am going. Amen. 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 Listen. Whilst I was meditating on the word, in fact, I was battling with what God wants me to do today. I'm telling you, I have battled from the morning till about five. So when it comes to the time even to pray for the people outside the UK, I was happy because it was like a relief. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you the truth. Praise God. What God was telling me to do, I didn't want to do it. I'm saying the truth. And God knows I'm speaking the truth. And it has been a battle all through. Because I have my own arrangement in my head. And he has decided to mess up the arrangement nicely for me. And I was battling. God, no, not this way. Praise God. But at the end of it all, when I decided, okay, fine. It was after five. I have finished praying for the people. I still don't know what I'm going to talk about because I'm confused. Then I decided, okay, fine. What do you want me to do? I'll do it. So I sat down, just pondering over the word. And then he took me that deep. When I came back to my senses, he said, look into your life for two years. Look into your own life for two years and let me show you what I have done. Hallelujah. Come on, is somebody get to the picture here. The Lord said, look into your own life for how many years? Two years. And let me show you what I have done. Over the years, you have done this, you have done that, there is nothing you've not done. I work, I know I work. I love this work I do and I work. Praise God. Amen. Nat came to me this evening. He sat down and saw this phone ringing, that one ringing. I am on Skype. This one is. He looked at me and said, Pastor, we can't have a meeting. I want to go. He left me. I couldn't even have a meeting I was going to have with him because people were in need and I had to do it. Is somebody understanding me? Yes. I work. Since you have worked, but I took two years of your life to change your whole life and bring you to a point where you can call success. Listen, it's not about how hard. Neither is it about how long. Oh, come on, somebody, are you understanding me? It's not about how eloquent, how smart you are. But I'm pleading with somebody. Leave it for him. I came to speak to all of us. Listen. I said it's not about how hard. It's not about how smart. In fact, it's not about how powerful you may think you are. Maybe you have some solid people behind you. So you depend on certain people. But if for the year 2002, you will depend on the Lord. Let it go. Leave everything. Follow his direction. Just obey him. Let him have his way. But sometimes, the things God tells you will sound stupidity to your own mind, to your human mind. It wouldn't really sit well. But be the fool and let God be wise. Do what he instructs you to do and watch him. See what will take place. I loved that bit yesterday when Jesus told Peter. He says, Peter, you will not understand, but you just do it and see the results. Oh, come on. Huh? Peter is trying to understand. He said, Peter, you will not understand, but you just do it and see what? The results. Look at somebody and tell them it's all about the results. Or tell another person it's all about the results. Tell the third person it's all about the results. Tell the fourth person it's all about the results. Ha! 
Hallelujah. Yeah. Yes, sir. If there is anyone here who is not looking for positive results in your coming here, please walk out of the door. Oh, did somebody hear what I said? Yes. They are what? Is everybody sitting down? Because you are here for results. Praise the name of the living God. Hallelujah. Drop it and hand it over to him for results. Now, I will, by the end of this program, I, I wish I would have everybody's name and then see your testimonies in the year 2012. I'm talking about testimonies. Hallelujah. I'm talking about what? Testimonies. Oh, you will be the story. People will share you as the story. Oh, have you heard about that brother? That God broke through in no time. Oh, the one that people thought it was over with. But the Lord. I'm talking about you here. Praise God. This program is based on a particular scripture. Joshua chapter number 3. Joshua chapter 3. And today we are reading only the verse 5. Joshua chapter 3, we are reading the verse 5. 2012, a year of explosive increase. Joshua chapter 3, reading the verse 5. And Joshua said unto the people, Sanctify yourselves, for tomorrow the Lord will do wonders among you. Look at somebody and tell them, Sanctify yourself. For tomorrow, the Lord will do wonders among you. Oh no, tell somebody for me that sanctify yourself. For tomorrow, the Lord will do wonders among you. Hallelujah. So the key word here is sanctify. The key word is what? Sanctify. And I've explained the word sanctify over and over. Sanctify, consecrate, set apart, hallelujah, Amen. to be made special for the use of the Lord. Amen? Amen. So be, make yourself special for the use of the Lord. Because tomorrow, the Lord is coming to do wonders among you. Amen. Praise the name of the Lord God. We picked, it, we picked it up and then we came to a point where I came to teach you that you are very special. Amen? Amen. You are very, very special. Oh, did we get that? Yes. Eh? That you are very, very what? Special. In fact, you are so special. Amen. You are special. That according to scripture, we are heirs of the Father. And the beauty is we are joint heirs with a son. Oh, come on. Hallelujah. Amen. And Bible says he calls us his sons. So I am a son of God. Oh, come on. Does somebody understand that? So if I am the son of God, then Jesus is my brother. My senior brother. And the Bible says we are adopted sons of God. If we are adopted children, then legally we qualify for every single blessing. In fact, we qualify for every single miracle that Jesus qualifies. Amen. 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 Because we have been permitted. That is what Jesus said. And he said, to those who believe in his name, he gave them the power to become the sons of God. Praise God. So I have the power to become the child of God. I've been given the authority. I have a note. That proof that I'm a child of God. In fact, I am not ordinary. I am special. I don't know about you, but I am special. Oh, I know, I know that I am special. I don't know about you, but I am special. Praise God. You know what? The world can talk about double recession, but I will talk about double prosperity. I will talk about explosive increase because that is my portion. In fact, I am special. If 